hi guys this is Soheb in this video I'm going to show you how to create an index using PCA instead of for PCA using SPSS please see my other video but I personally suggest you to choose data as it is easy short and give you one final index as compared to SPSS where you get two or more components usually so let's get started first of all we are gonna add data in the data editor so here in this window we are going to paste our data I have already taken my data and uh, in the Excel sheet so these are the five variables representing my financial development so I'm going to create a financial development index using these five variables uh, okay let's select them so data for Pakistan and then copy them now paste now you have to paste it as treat first row as variables if you have selected your variables with your data uh, in that way your variables will be shown up over here and uh, remember that your variable should not contain any space because as data might not take such variables with the space so after pasting them over here now go back to the data now there are two ways either you can use the command of PCA or you can go to the statistics multivariate analysis factor and principal component analysis and PCA if I just click it it will automatically run the results but I'm going through the to show you how to run through it with the command right PCA in the command section space and the variables names are shown over here you can see them over here or you just can write them dmbll sorry bll space cba pc space s and c now just press enter and it will run the results so here you can see that the first component is showing almost 60% of variation this is the first component lot of five components and the second component is showing almost 25 and the rest of them are showing pretty much less variation so based on the icon values usually greater than one are selected so it might create an index using first two components then we have to write the command to rotate rotate it. press enter what it will give you it gives you the orthogonal very max it gives you the variation of each variable in each component so then we are going to finally write over here predict and space and whichever uh, the variable you want to name for my financial draft index I'm going to write FD so I'm going with FT press enter now after predict you will go to the data window and there you will see that a six column uh, this is the final index these values you can use in your regression or, or wherever you want to use it as your final index so that's pretty much it thanks for watching please subscribe for more videos thank you